Hello everyone! Welcome to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I want to talk about this unusual shaped succulent that we have in here. This succulent is called Sinisio peregrinus or in the Philippines we call this a string of dolphins because it literally looks like a tiny dolphin hanging from those green stem. I decided to make a video about this uh, plant because it's been sitting there for a while, for five months actually since I got them and then I think that that was enough experience for me to share it to you what I've learned of taking good care of this plant. Also, I have uh, made some experiments on this plant me to see how does it survive in this video also you're gonna see what will you expect of this plant and what if problems would you encounter when you're taking good care of this plant these spots of a string of dolphins are different in appearance isn't it it is because in the past few months i treated them differently this greener pot right here, I water it normally and put it to the morning sun, but I return it in the shade in the afternoon. Notice how plump and healthy those leaves are, and the color is also vibrant. As for the other pot, I expose them to direct sunlight all day long with less watering and I kind of don't like the way it turned out because the leaves shrink and I can't see those legs of dolphins and also Sinisius have flowers they're like tiny little white ones with yellow blushes that are compacted together and as I water this plant over I notice the big big problem aside from just shrink leaves i noticed that there are aphids on this plant and i know i had to deal with them as early as possible so i need to put them into quarantine and uh, deal with them where where i could be uh, confident that this plants will not invade my healthy succulents so if you want to know how I deal with uh, these bugs or the aphids, you might want to click the subscription below and be updated of the next video that I will upload about aphids. In terms of watering, if, uh, the if you see the leaves of this plant that has shrinked or they're um dolphin bell bellies were close together and that's the time you know that you are under watering them when you water you have to be careful not to over water them if you see that the leaves turns yellow like this then you might want to reschedule your watering to the next day or the secret of keeping this plant beautiful and healthy is their access to nice sunlight and normal watering. Remember that you should not treat this plant as a cactus. Keep the soil at least 10% moist and water it normally. I would recommend also to give this plant a bright morning sunlight and a part shade in the afternoon. If you are growing this inside your house, then you may want to put it to your windowsill. If you don't, these dolphins will lose its tiny little legs and it will not look like a dolphin anymore. I have a really great success in propagating this plant and if you want to try it your own and go ahead and cut those long ones long stems and put them back in the ground and just a week or two they will start rooting and will provide you another healthy string of dolphin that's it for this video thank you for watching and i'll see you in another one Bye bye